Though the Battle of Chibi was won, it did not result in a halt to the war. Instead, the land entered into the Three Kingdoms period, with the three great generals, Cao Cao, Sun Quan, and Liu Bei, each holding ground. Liu Bei and Sun Quan attacked simultaneously from the south and the west. In an effort to split up Cao Cao's forces, Cao Cao sent Zhang Liao towards Heifei to beat back the army of Wu. Zhang Liao's fighting spirit soared higher than the heavens. Wu's forces, marching towards us here at Heifei, and Liu Bei, lurking in the far west, always menacing our flanks. Why is it that men are so eager to spread chaos across the land? Why must all the fighting go on? I know why. Because men have free choice. We're free to choose the dream we die for. And when you have found something to believe in, you will fight to achieve it. The warrior is merely a tool. And as such, he fights to make the dream come true. Hmm. So when there are so many dreams, it is inevitable that men will fight each other and cross swords. Then if there is no other way, we must make it our goal to use our swords to bring an end to this chaos.
Enemy officer defeated. Enemy officer defeated. My lord, enemy reinforcements are approaching. Ah, an excellent display of skill. We must keep up our own end of the fight. Mark me? Don't make me laugh. Enemy officer defeated. Day. You dare not face Zhang Liao! Well, you have polished your skills, I see. You have become a masterful warrior. 
Yes, even I who fight with you feel a bit scared. In the time since I joined this army, I have crossed paths with many fine warriors, including yourself. I am a better warrior. I'm free of all doubt. I can give all I have to achieve our goals. Hmm. You've done well. Perhaps too well. It may soon be you, Zhang Liao, standing at the forefront of the armies of Wei. <laughs>